All right, here's another little video. This is a silicone rubber mold. This particular mold, um, I don't know if you can see what it is right there, but um, this is one of my homemade flat cars. And it does have some resin castings on it. But what I'm interested in showing today are the K-rails. These K-rails, as you can see, they have little brass parts on there that are the lift rings and the, uh, um, you know, you can actually plug these together like this, put a pin through it, and make a series of K-rails. Now, the fun thing about these K-rails and I was told by the manufacturer of the product that I used to make them that by making them out of this, they will last for about 30 years outside. Now, how is that possible? Well, it's a particular type of material. Now, this, each of these K-Rails with the brass inserts cast in it was made in this simple silicone one-part mold. And what do you ask are these made out of? Well, they are real cement. This is made out of the same stuff that they make highways out of. And if you can look up close, there's some beautiful detail in there. You even got little micro bubbles, just like the real concrete. And they're the same color all the way through. So if they break, you'll have, it'll look just like a real K-Rail. So anyway, that's what I wanted to show you that resin, is, resin isn't the only thing that you can use in these molds. And for almost any indoor outdoor application, you have cement, you have resin, you have, you can even use it as a jello mold. Wouldn't that be cool? A K-rail shaped jello mold. So anyway, um, that's all I wanted to show, just a really short one, but uh, these are a lot of fun. See you next time. I feel like Tim the Tool Time guy.